some feedback from the principal that uh, our discussion about sex, I, I mean about gender, wasn't uh, precise enough. And, uh, well, he, he gave me some guidelines how to do a more uh, uh, thorough pass, helping you identify your gender. Okay. Is the gender that you were assigned with at birth the gender that you currently identify with? Okay. Just, uh, whenever you're ready. Oh, okay, great. So as you know, that means that you're cisgendered. Okay, great. Now, the next thing I want to talk to you about with your gender is your sexuality. Now, a lot of people think that gender and sexuality are the same, but no, that's bi. That's wrong. It's bi. Okay. Now, how would you describe the sex of the kinds of people you find yourself, uh, sexually attracted to? Okay, anytime. anytime. All. Okay, okay. Okay, are you attracted to both binary genders, male and female, or do you find multiple genders beyond the binary definitions attractive? Okay. Okay, do you find yourself sexually attracted to some genders or all genders? Pansexual, then. Okay, okay. Take your time. <laughs> well, I'm really glad we had this talk, okay? Just be careful, okay? Because there's, there's a lot of people out there who don't accept you for what you are, and then you're going to have to deal with them, okay? So, uh, but come see me anytime. What can I do for you, new kid? Too. We don't take kindly to your types around here. Let's welcome this thing to our town. We don't take kindly to your types around here. Let's mess with some physics. Now you see me? You got these backpacks? He was here like a second ago. If you actually read the Constitution, you'd understand it's my patriarchy duty to... Really good feeling about this, guys. This might sting. Ah, Try not to slip on your own guts. I'd hate for you to fall and hurt yourself. I'm big again! Oh, Jesus, not again! <laughs> I might need a do-over. Okay, bye for now. Now you're gonna get it. Fuck with the 
Raccoon, you answer to his friends, right, guys? Avenging you is on my to-do list. You bastard! Brutalist is getting brutalized. But Lord, I have to say I'm mildly impressed with the progress you're making. Come to the coon lair. I've got a little surprise for you. Coon out. I'm the f f fastest kid in town. You better run fast. <laughs> See you, new kid.
get scrambles fast. No, 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 no. We can't do the Super Craig movie before the Human Kite Netflix series, guys. That doesn't make any sense. Well, what about introducing Super Craig in the second Coon and Friends movie? That'd be pretty DC Comics of us. I wouldn't recommend it. Ah, Butt Lord, please have a seat. Sorry, guys. Can I have a moment with Butt Lord, please? Sure thing. Come on, Fast Pass. Uh... Right behind you, Mosquito. <laughs> But Lord, I just wanted to let you know that we've decided to let you have your own Netflix series right after the Fast Pass Fox miniseries and the third Coon and Friends United movie. Congratulations. Okay, well, get out there and finish your goals. Just, uh, wanted to tell you the exciting news. What do you want, new kid? I already let you dual class. There's nothing left to talk about. Oh, no. No, 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 no. You are not going to have three classes. New kid? New kid, no, do not give me those sad puppy eyes. Nobody gets to be three classes. It, you think that just because you had to live through your dad fucking your mom, you should get all the sympathy in the world, don't you? <sighs> I'm sorry. I didn't mean to bring that up. All right, all right, fine. If you were going to add another class, what would it be? Assassin. Gadgeteer. Assassin. Assassin, hope you're not squeamish about blood. Oh, a gadgeteer, like Tupperware. Are you rich too? So yeah, what an amazing moment for you. You must be excited. Okay, but if you're gonna be triple class, then we have to change your backstory. It is pretty dumb. Let's go back in time again. Back to when you were just a child. You couldn't sleep that night, but it was because you saw strange lights in the sky. You walked to the mirror. And in the mirror, you saw a kid who maybe wasn't from this world. And that's when you heard it. Strange alien sounds from the hallway. You walked out and saw two intruders and an alien in your house. You had to stop them, so you called upon your new powers. As an assassin hero, you sharpened your blades and prepared to do what you do best, kill. Wasting no time, you drew first blood with a quick cut attack on the nearest foe. Bloodied, your target called for his companions to aid him. Hey, that kid has a knife. Oh shit, seriously? Even as he lost blood, the intruder swung his crowbar wildly at your face. Uh. You needed to get out of the fray and back into the shadows. Get back into the shadows now, okay? Whoa, whoa! Hey, where'd that little shit go? Bewildered, the villain searched for any trace of your whereabouts. I got a bad feeling about this. Ugh! You stealthily crept into position to execute your next move. Your spin slash sent a fury of fishing knives in all directions. This is for my fellow home invader. Mortally wounded, the last standing foe charged at you and let loose a blood-fueled onslaught. Oh. It was do or die. You were him.
Skinny, see what hit him as he slinked back into the shadows. That kid's like some kind of super assassin. The alien took you by the hand and led you into a dark room. And that's when you saw that your dad had just fucked your mom. Whoa, boy, that is pretty tragic, new kid. I'm so sorry. Were the aliens helping you by showing you who fucked your mom, or were they trying to make you full of rage? You might never know. All right, get back out there, butt lord. You still have a lot of things to do. Welcome to the King Store. Authorized users only. The King Store thanks you for your purchase. You're welcome. <laughs>